the art exhibition is for the learners to display their work and to show off the, their achievements over the two year course. It gives uh, parents and carers the opportunity to come along and to celebrate with us on, on what, all the hard work that they've done over the two years. The exam element of the course is a practical exam. It takes up 40% of their final grade. There are seven different starting points which are given to us by the exam board which are very varied. The learners have to choose one of those questions and then they do a personal response to that question over a, a few months um, and it accumulates in a final 10 hour exam piece under time conditions. Children have worked really hard to um, eventually meet deadlines and choose the right question for them so I think the quality um, in my opinion is, is a cut above last year so I'm actually secretly really pleased with it. I feel like my exam there was a lot of work put into it and a lot of research and I also feel um, the script work because we did um, two aspects, we did like old fashioned scripts and new scripts and how it's used in magazines and things like that. So I think with those contrasting against each other it makes a nice composition. Those um, journeys as a topic and a mix, and instead of doing the uh, typical like movement or something of journeys, I've mixed in fashion, which is what I like. Um, so I tried to make it interesting and on my exam is when everything that I've done in year 10 and 11 has come together to make one big thing. I chose Art and Words and I had to pick um, either a poem, a song, a story and like kind of like interpret it into like a final piece. So I picked the song Birdhouse in Your Soul and I, for my final piece I did three birdhouses. I used paper and like tissue paper and things like that and paints and then I used like bits of broken jewellery and things like that. I chose art and design and I did Barack Obama and did all his speech and stuff and made it all more I used different backgrounds like newspaper and then faded out with white, um, painted backgrounds with uh, writing over it and then actually worked into that. Um, I did a map that was ghosted out with white paint and then worked over that with biro and then I also stuck another canvas on top of my actual canvas to make it a bit more 3D. It pretty much allowed me to do anything that I wanted to do as long as it was a close-up of that piece. So I thought I could like expand everything that I did. As always, this year's artwork is really varied in terms of the learner's personal response to tasks. Uh, we generally give a thematic approach to, to projects and then they can interpret it in lots of different ways. And as always, you know, as I say, it's always very individual and unique and yeah, we're really pleased with well, the results this year.